by section method using python programming consider an example f of x is equal to e raised to minus x minus sin x first we want to determine an interval containing root for that put x is equal to 0 then f of 0 is equal to e raised to 0 minus sin 0 so e sin 0 is 0 e raised to 0 is 1 and therefore f of 0 is 1 which is greater than 0 now put x is equal to 1 then f of 1 is equal to e raised to minus 1 minus sin 1 which is equal to minus 0 0.4736 which is less than 0 now since since f of 0 since f of 0 is greater than 0 and f of 1 is negative f of 0 is positive f of 1 is negative this implies f of 0 into f of 1 is less than 0 and therefore uh, root lies between an interval 0 and 1 now first iteration by using first iteration by using first iteration by using bisection method for that consider a is equal to 0 b is equal to 1 then c is equal to a plus b divided by 2 which is equal to 0 0.5 now we want to determine sin of f of c so f of c is equal to f of 0 0.5 which is equal to e raised to minus 0 0.5 minus sin 0 0.5 if you solve this then f of c is equal to f of 0 0.5 is equal to 0 0.1271 1, now now since since f of 0 0.5 is greater than 0 from 0 f of 0 and f of 1 f of 1 is less than 0 less than 0 and therefore root lies between 0 0.5 and 1 so here first iteration is completed now next next consider a, a second iteration second iteration second iteration now put here a is equal to 0 0.5 and b is equal to 1 in the previous iteration we replace our a by c we replace here in previous iteration we replace uh, 0 by 0 0.5 so the length of interval is decreased now next again we want to determine c c is what 0 0.5 plus 1 divided by 2 which is equal to 0 0.75 and if we find the value if we determine the value of f of 0 0.75 which is equal to uh, e raised to minus 0 0.75 75 minus sin 0 0.75 if we solve this then the f of 0 0.75 is equal to minus 0 0.20 minus 0 0.2093 okay now if you observe f of 0 0.75 f of 0 0.75 is less than 0 and from the previous interval that is from 0 0.5 and 1 f of 1 uh, f of 0 0.5 is greater than 0 f of 0 0.5 is greater than 0 and therefore root lies between an interval 0 0.5 and 0 0.75 continue in this way we can uh, we can find a value of c such that the our root will be correct up to 3 or 4 decimal places or we can stop our iteration when uh, when the two successive roots are correct up to 3 or 4 decimal places now we are going to code bisection method in python programming so now first we are going to import uh, math library by import uh, math now we want to define a function define f of x is equal to return return math dot exp minus x minus sin math dot th math dot sin x now want to enter the value of a 
So, first initial guess A is equal to integer input input enter first first initial guess guess then similarly want to enter second initial guess. So, b is equal to integer input input enter your second initial guess guess. Now, if want to check whether f of a into f of b f of b is greater than 0. If f of a into f of b is greater than 0 means what uh, bisection method is what fails. We can print and message bisection method method fails bisection method fails. Now, else else that is if f of a into f of b is less than 0 in that case next uh, uh, now uh, we are uh, we are defining here error is equal to float we assume initial error is what infinity 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 now while 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 error is greater than 0 0.01 or 0 0.01 then then we, we, are, uh, we want to determine value of c c is equal to a plus b a plus b divided by divided by 2 c is equal to a plus b divided by 2 now now if if f of a into f of c is less than 0 f of a into f of c is less than 0 then we want to replace b is equal to c else else replace replace a is equal to a is equal to c replace a is equal to c now uh, want to determine uh, error the new value of error is equal to absolute value of absolute value of a minus b a minus b and finally want to print the value of c print the, the root of the given equation root of the given equation or root is equal to say root is equal to root is equal to say c root is equal to c now if we compile this program then okay so i am maximizing this uh, console okay first initial guess so we enter if our first initial guess say 0 and second initial guess say 1 then we get an uh, approximate root of the given function equation by using bisection method. You can observe here these uh, last two roots are correct up to three decimal places. How many iteration you can also print number of iteration uh, number of iteration by defining here define if we take here n is equal to 0 how many iteration it requires. So, if you define n is equal to uh, 0 then and if you add here n is equal to n plus 1 then number of iterations is equal to you can print here iterations you require here iteration iteration is equal to n iteration is equal to n. So, again if you compile this uh, first initial guess I am maximizing this console first initial guess say 0 and second uh, initial guess say 1 then at iteration 1 how many iteration it require it require iteration 10. Now, again uh, if you require more accuracy then you can uh, you can 
increase here uh, you can decrease the here instead of uh, 0 0.001 you can write here 0 0.0001. So, in that case how many iteration you require again I am compiling this uh, program and if you enter here say first initial case say 0 and then 1 then it require 14 iteration. Similarly, okay, so after 14 iteration the successive 2 roots uh, uh, the error between successive 2 roots is uh, less than 0 0.001. So, thank you.